What do you think, Betty? Time to go to the post office? Oh yeah. Let's get it in the right gear. Oh yeah, we're gonna weave our way down Moon Crater Highway here. Here. Turn that down. Holy buckets. Rocking out. Uh, yeah. So we're going to go and check the mail. You want to go too, Betty? We're lucky the postmistress here likes Betty. Uh, this is Saturday, so nobody's here. Welcome to the little post office. This is it. This is my post office. 360 degree view. Not a whole lot here. That's a fact. So, right baby? Yeah. Oh boy. We got a package. All right. Good girl. So let me show you the little scenes that I can see as I drive around my neighborhood up here on the mountain. <clears throat> when I say the mountain, I mean Mount Hood. I'm going to show you out the window of the Jeep here what's going on. Isn't that beautiful moss? Beautiful little creek. This is Henry Creek and Rhododendron. You can walk right down there, stand right down there and take a photograph up there. I just did the other day as a matter of fact. There's a little bit more water in it today than there was the other day, though. Beautiful! I love where I live. <laughs> All right, well, we just got done visiting with some folks that were kind of cool. And uh, I dropped off a, a uh, metal print for a donation for a cancer event for uh, cancer research and uh, dropped off some calendars and uh, now we're getting ready to move on down the road and see what other kind of uh, mischief we can get into. Hi oh, Betty. Get your ball, little dog. Get your ball. Let's go walk. Good girl. Let's go this way. Yes. There's Sandy River near Welch's, Oregon. We've been talking about fake rainbows on my Facebook page last couple of days. It's been kind of a lively conversation, but here's a spot that I plan on getting a rainbow photograph someday. I've seen a couple of them here, kind of faint, but I can picture a bright one right over this river right over here. So mark my word, one of these days I'm going to have this photograph with a rainbow over the top of it. Yeah, well. <laughs> Yeah, happy dog. Oh. You are the happy dog. Oh. What are you happy about? Oh. Oh. Huh? 
What are you so happy about? Where's your ball? Where is it? Where is your ball at? Where's your ball? Where'd you take it? You put it somewhere. Oh. Where is the ball? Oh. 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 Go get your ball. Go get your ball. It's over there. Good girl. You're such a good girl. Yeah. So we're uh, down at the Thurman Dog Park again today. Because we like it here so well. Get your ball. Good dog. Now we're going to go to the store and get a few little things. For the view out my window. They replanted some trees from the flood that we had here and they rebuilt this whole area up. But this is the Sandy River. We got a brand new retaining wall up here. Isn't this something? Kind of cool. Just for our little bitty Barlow Trail Road. But this river can be awful mean. This river can be up to the road during flood stage. Practically up to the road, I should say. Anyway. Gotta go. <clears throat> well, we're back home. Traveling down Moon Crater Boulevard. What do you think, a bitty dog? I love a bitty dog. Daddy loves bitty dog. Yes, he does. I got kisses today. Yeah. Biddy must be happy. Are you happy dog? So, okay, we're home. It's almost time for biscuits. I need to bring the video recorder into the Thriftway store one of these times when I'm in there because uh, if you're not from a little town, you probably wouldn't understand, but because we're such a small town, as I'm walking through the store, I probably saw six people that I know. So it's almost like as you're going through, you stop and give each other a hug or say hi or a high five or something like that and then uh, catch up on uh, what's been going on and then you go down the, the aisle, turn the corner and there's somebody else you know. And So I've been going to this Thriftway store since the 1980s which has been quite a while now but uh, it's always been that way it seems like everybody goes in they talk about the gossip and then they complain about the prices of Thriftway and then we go on our way so it's kind of a tradition up here on the mountain. Anyway, <laughs> well, these days I'll bring in a GoPro, put a GoPro on me or something like that and go through and and show you how many people I say hello to and stuff as I go through the store. It's kind of cool. So anyway. Hi little dog. How you doing? Are you happy? Yes you are. So Yesterday I was coming back to the towards the PPV and I could hear some squeaking like a bird or something squeaking. I didn't think much of it, you know. I live in the forest for crying out loud. And, but as I got to the house, Darlene is crying because she witnessed a bird go up in a tree and take out another bird. And uh, it was a varied thrush. We came over here yesterday to, you know, to see what was happening. I could see now that the bird is gone, so something wild has taken it. But, yeah, there's a few feathers and stuff down there, but Darlene was in, the, in that back corner in the home at there, and the window was open so she could hear it and she could see it. And she watched the whole thing, and boy, it sure did upset her, so. But, yeah, it's all gone now. All gone. Well, I'm back home at the uh, home at. 
in my office here so I'm gonna sit down and try to get some of my own stuff done here I've been working on a few uh, client projects and stuff and uh, I have a lot of things that I've got to do for myself and my business so I've got to make my list go down the list check them all off and try to get them done so trying my best to try to do more of these uh, daily vlogs these video blogs and post them on my YouTube channel so uh, I'd appreciate it if you guys would go and check out my YouTube channel subscribe give me a thumbs up if you like the video give me a thumbs down if you don't and uh, leave a comment chew me out tell me I'm doing something good leave a comment so anyway uh, hopefully those, these will get better in the future this is kinda rough I'm buying a few little gizmos and things to help me uh, put these together and um, yeah hopefully I'll refine them and and uh, figure out how to do this and effectively and uh, I'm hoping that through some of these little videos that I put together that I'll be able to uh, kinda help help you guys out with some of the photography questions that you've had and uh, give you a little insight into my life and what I go through and uh, what I do and uh, yeah and so um, just go check out my YouTube channel I got a few videos up there anyways already so it will give you something to do for a while a couple of them are uh, some uh, instructional videos too hopefully help you with your photography so anyway Thanks for everything. I'm going to cut this one off. I'm going to try to uh, process this into a little video. And uh, there you go. And uh, I'll uh, talk to you soon. Take care. Bye.